Oh, hey, what's up guys? I didn't see you guys there. Anyway, um, yeah, Furious Francis here. Okay, so, EmpireEssence.com, there's some big news. Yes, big news. Mega Man creator, the developer himself, the co-creator actually, but a lot of people credit him to creating Mega Man, Kenji Inafune, has now announced that there is a new Mega Man inspired game called Mighty Number no. 9. It is on Kickstarter right now and it is currently racking up the money. When I first started writing the story, it was at $114,000. By the time I finished writing the story, which was just a couple minutes later, it was over $118,000. They were racking up the money literally by the thousands by the minute i mean it is insane right now i'm going to go over some of the details and i want you guys to head over to playeressence.com check out the video and read the rest but for right now i'm going to quickly give you guys some of the details on the game mighty number no. nine is an all-new japanese side-scrolling action game that takes the best aspects of the 8 and 16-bit era classics you know and love and transforms them into a modern tech well transforms them with modern tech fresh mechanics and fan input into something fresh and amazing you play as Beck, the ninth in a line of powerful robots, and the only one not infected by a mysterious computer virus that caused mechanical creatures the world over to go berserk. Run, jump, blast, and transform your way through six stages or more via stretch goals, and you can tackle them in any order you choose, using weapons and abilities stolen from your enemies to take down your fellow mighty number robots and confront the final evil that threatens the planet. Holy crap, this game is going to be awesome. They're putting in bad feedback. They're letting you have the same Mega Man ability, being able to absorb the powers and use them against your foes. It's classic 8 to 16-bit stuff, you know what I'm saying? The old school stuff that... I and many people love growing up as a kid. I cannot wait to play this game. Make sure you check out the description below. Hit the link, follow it over to playerss.com. We've got a video up on there. We've got screenshots. Plus, we've got the Kickstarter page to where you can go over there and back the project. Also, I want you guys to check out, of course, on playerss.com, the comment section and on YouTube here. Leave your comments. What do you guys think about this game? Are you guys going to back it? Please let me know because I think this game is fantastic. Now, as far as platforms go, right now they're only worried about PC, uh, Mac, and Linux, but they are going to have stretch goals, okay? So they're going to have stretch goals for home consoles. It hasn't been stated what home consoles it's going to be. If it's going to be last generation or if it's going to be next gen, Wii U, PS4, Xbox One. We don't know, but they did say that they're going to have stretch goals for home consoles so you can bank on it that it's probably going to be uh, PS3, Xbox 360, and uh, Wii you support as far as home consoles go, maybe PS4 uh, support as well, or PS Vita. So we will see great news. Like I said, I cannot wait to play this game, although it is going to be a little bit of a wait. They're, they're aiming for a 2015 digital release, so it is going to be a while, but still, the excitement just being able to follow this project from now until it releases because it's going to get funded. They're already, I bet you anything by now, it's over $200,000 easily. So this game's going to get funded. It's going to be awesome. Definitely check it out when you get a chance. And also just want to give a couple of um, notes. What's going on as far as original content on YouTube and on the site. Now, if you haven't checked out my new show that I have, the Player Essence Retro Show, check it out. I got some cool stuff that I'm talking about as far as some of my favorite Nintendo games. Remember, that was just episode one. Many more to come. Probably every single week I'm going to be delivering that show for you guys. I probably want to keep it as a weekend thing because I think it's kind of cool. You know, weekends when you have time to play retro games, maybe to revisit some of those games. But every single weekend, you'll we'll probably get a new retro show. And we're going to follow, we're going to ride this thing out. I know I got a lot of good feedback from you guys and I want to continue uh, doing that. So please make sure you check out the, the retro show when you get a chance. All right. So this is Farius Frank signing off for PlayerEssence.com. Remember, like I said, check the description. Also join our Facebook page uh, on Player Essence. Like us on Facebook. You get all of our exclusive content sent straight to your PC, phone, or tablet. Please share this video, like, and subscribe if you haven't. Trust me, there's plenty more to come. All right, we will see you guys on PlayerEssence.com. Peace.